Moving on now, the oil-rich country Kazakhstan is holding parliamentary elections today with the ruling party expected to sweep the votes as it has been since the last two decades. The elections here have been infamous for electoral fraud, repression of opposition candidates and restrictions on a free press. Now what is unusual in these elections is that the nation is going to the polls with one thing missing, an opposition. The only opposition party, the National Social Democratic Party, has boycotted the ballot as a protest against the unfair system. Another opposition party has failed to secure official registration ahead of the vote. Meanwhile, what civil rights activists and opposition politicians claim is that Kazakh authorities have intentionally refused to officially register opposition political groups in recent months. They accuse it of being a government ploy to prevent opposition parties from participating in the elections. Now, coming to the ones who are standing for the elections, along with the Nurotam 4, other political parties loyal to the government are taking part in the elections. Now, remember, after Narazbayev came down from his position in 2019, President Kasim Jomat Tokayev became his successor. He is the senior member of the Nurotan political party, which currently controls 84 of the 107 seats in Kazakhstan's lower house. None of the party's four competitors in the race have openly criticized Nazarbayev or Takayev, and experts claim that he is expected to win a commanding majority in the lower house. The most notable candidate on the ballot is Nazarbayev's eldest daughter, 57-year-old Dariga Nazarbayev, who is representing Nurotan. Her return to politics comes just eight months after Tokayev fired her from the position of Senate Speaker, the role that places the occupant second in line to the president. While a lot of voters will be avoiding the ballot due to the rigged nature of the elections and the raging pandemic, all eyes are on who will be the next president of the resource-rich nation of Central Asia. Co-presented by Skoda. Simply clever. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.